Uh, welcome to another uh, edition of my life on the run. Um, I'm on a train right now from London, Ontario to Toronto and, uh, and it's snowing outside and uh, I'm with the irrepressible and lovely Deanna and it's snowing and windy outside. We're going from London, Ontario to Toronto and then tomorrow we go to Europe back to Bucharest and the thing that's interesting about what I just did in London, Ontario is I is uh, I, I visited an old friend of mine I've known this guy for 15 years and, uh, some of you may have heard him we've talked about him before he's uh, he just turned 90 yesterday it was his 90th birthday so we stopped we flew from Vancouver to London, Ontario to to celebrate his birthday with him and, and a couple of his close relatives and uh, uh, his name is Bill and Bill has been an inspiration to me for many years I used to go for lunch with him uh, almost daily and we used to have great conversations about life and women and, and relationships and travel and history and he's an interesting guy because he's a, you know one of the last of the renaissance men he speaks 11 languages he's, tra he's, he's traveled the world he's lived in Paris, New York and we're all over the world he's, um, he's a complete scoundrel and he always has been and um, he was a uh, was in World War II, he was in the in, in Canadian Intelligence Corps, and in Korean War, he was in the Canadian Signal Corps, and in the Vietnam War, he was a translator and a consultant, and um, so he's, he's done a few things, and and um, uh, and he's always. This is the inspir inspiring part about this about this man. I have I've known him for many years, and I've spent much time with him, and I have never once seen him seen him anything other than relaxed, smiling. Uh, winking, enjoying his life, telling the stories of the day, and and his wife Patricia, who just died two months ago, um, used to tell me. She said, "You know, I've been married to him for 38 years, and I've never seen him anything but that spirit." She said, "I've never seen him depressed or down or upset or angry about anything. He just he takes everything in stride and embodies the entire concept that I've been trying to to." Incorporated into my own life and into and, and trying to talk about the concept of ease and delight. And Bill is an inspiration to me. And it was I shared his 90th birthday with him. I'm very happy for that. And uh, he will be moving to Ottawa soon, I understand. And um, I will be visiting him every few months when I go through Canada. I'm going to stop in Ottawa. It's my plan to visit my friend Bill. And so, um, good man. Anyway. Um, so what's happening with uh, with me is my my by the time you see this my my printed version of the book will have been sent out to all the people who contributed to my Indiegogo campaign. In other words, the people who wanted a signed copy. I've I, I've done half of them right now, and the other half is going to happen in the next few days. And uh, so by the time you see this video, those videos those should be out. The book is is selling well, and. Um, and, and I'm getting great responses from people. A lot of emails coming in saying, you know, how, how much they are getting value from the book, which is the greatest thing that I can hope for, and I'm, I'm happy about that. And, um, and I still can't believe it's done. I'm still trying to sort that out in my head, like, and trying to put my head above above the water, and see what's what. And um, so now we are in Indiana. We're on our way to Toronto, and I'm going to be doing some small events. Uh, doing one in Toronto to today, and uh, in Amsterdam, in Oslo, in where else? London. In in London, actual London, not London, yeah. Ontario. <laughs> and where else? Uh, Berlin. 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 Yeah. And maybe maybe I'll put a few more on there, but I'm not sure. Uh, I'm going to be doing a lot less events. On TV next coming year to concentrate on, on some other uh, programming and systems. Uh, our university is getting a revamp. Um, I've got our, our team with led by Hans is is is, is recreating some of our products and, and our events and this kind of stuff. So it's going to be a, a busy and important year and we're excited for it and uh, we've got some great things coming down the pipe. Um, if you want to get my if you want to get my book 
I would be excited and happy. Just you get it on Amazon.com. Search for the Alabaster Girl on Amazon, and um, yeah, and I think that's uh, that's it. This is uh, my life on the run, and I'm on the run from London, Ontario, to Toronto, and um, yeah, there's people on the train, and I'm still outside.